Good morning and welcome to a day in my life as a summer intern in Toronto. I am currently interning at a tech company and I've been working here for quite a while. They originally hired me on for the winter semester, but after that they decided to rehire me on for the summer semester as well. So today I'm going to take you through a day in my life. As you saw this morning, I woke up at around 8.30 and then I got ready and I start my job at 9 a.m. I just start my day by checking my emails and then I have my day Daily scrum which is my morning meeting with my team at 9 15 every single day where we just talk about the tasks that we're working on and any kind of blockers that might be obstacles to those tasks today I do have a call later with my vice president to go over the slide deck for her upcoming management meeting which is one of my recurring monthly responsibilities so I have that call later on that's why I'm dressed slightly more professionally today I usually show up in a t-shirt and my whole team pretty much is very very casual working in the tech industry You definitely do not need to be dressed like this every day But today I decided to look a little bit nicer for my call with the VP And we're just gonna be going through the slide deck that I am responsible for and we're just gonna see what she wants in this month's slide deck So that's one of my monthly responsibilities is just creating the slide deck for the management meeting where our VP of my department will present to the C-level executive so it's very high visibility aside from several recurring responsibilities that I have monthly I would say the bulk of my internship has just been doing a lot of ad hoc tasks whether that's extracting data for people and doing a lot of data analysis or I'm helping other people format their slide decks for customer calls or for internal meetings as well and then I have also been working on a lot of different operations projects behind the scenes for our team where we implement implement a lot of different software so I've been helping out with the implementation and the training and the enablement for all of those software to make sure that they run smoothly with our team. I am going to hop on my daily scrum now so I will talk to you a little bit later. I just hopped off my call with the VP just to go over what she wants in the PowerPoint. So before that, I was working on a couple of different ad hoc tasks for different people, creating some documentation, and then I did a little bit of data analysis for some people. So now it is almost lunchtime. I'm probably just gonna have salad because we don't have much left in the fridge. I usually call my friends and we watch a K-drama together. We just have a little bit of a Netflix party at lunchtime because we all have pretty much the same lunch breaks. So I'll go make myself some lunch and I will see you probably afterwards. Now my lunch break, I just made some food. We literally have nothing left in our fridge, so I just have a super basic salad that I shook up with my favorite sesame dressing. And then I reheated some of these corn dog nuggets that my sister's friend made for us. They're like mini corn dogs and my friends are still working. So before I called them, I just wanted to take some time to talk to you about what it's like to work from home. There's definitely some pros and cons to it. It's great to just roll out of bed and be able to have a not even a minute walk commute. I live with my sister and my roommate and we're all working from home. So I take the dining table and that's where my setup is. We each kind of have different sections of the apartment that we get to ourselves and that's been working pretty well but if I had the choice I would probably want to do my internship in person just to be able to meet people physically because I do see my team every single day and I have calls with different people but it's definitely not the same as actually working around a lot of people and being able to bump into people at the office and for the past two semesters that I've been working this internship I have never set foot into my company's office and it's slowly starting to open up so now people are heading back to the office 
office, but I don't think I'll be able to do that before my internship ends. But working from home definitely teaches you a lot of really great skills, like being autonomous and being proactive. So I've definitely learned so much from this internship. I've gained so many soft skills and hard skills, and it's been a really great experience so far. But yeah, I'm gonna eat my lunch and then call my friends to watch our K-drama together, and I'll talk to you afterwards. So now it is around 2 p.m. I just finished up some of the ad hoc tasks that I was doing for some of my team members and now I'm gonna start working on the slide deck that I was mentioning earlier and I pretty much just have to do a lot of different formatting things. They're just making sure all of the fonts and all of the logos are properly placed in the right spots and just making sure that everything is according to the branding guidelines and then I just update a couple of data points on there as well and I have to reach out to a couple of different people to get some of the data points so that is what I'm gonna be doing for the rest of the day because this is like more of like a mindless task where I don't have to think too hard about it especially because I've done it so many times I like to listen to a podcast or an audiobook while I do it and right now I am going to listen to the midnight library which is apparently a book that was trending on TikTok, and I've heard really good things about it so yeah that's what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day and I'll probably catch you when I'm done it is just past 5 p.m. and I am done for the day and now I'm gonna go make some dinner so we do not have a lot in our fridge today, so I think I'm going to make a Thai basil tofu with some zucchini and then I'm going to make some rice to go with it. So let's get cooking. got this Thai basil plant here that we don't use nearly enough but I'm gonna cut some leaves off of it so that we can put it into today's recipe
I just showered and washed my hair obviously I'm just gonna let it air dry now but as you saw after I finished work I pretty much just cook dinner and then we eat dinner together in front of the TV and today we were watching Big Brother after that I called my friend Katie and we talked for a little bit before we worked out we've been following the Chloe Ting programs pretty consistently for like almost a year now yeah so for the next hour or two I'm just going to be learning Spanish I ordered this book off of Amazon it's been really cool to realize that I already know so many words in Spanish without even studying it at all but I'm excited to continue on with this with lesson two today and I'm gonna be taking it notes in my little notebook here so I'm probably just gonna be doing that for the next couple of hours but that's pretty much all I do in a regular day in my life as a summer intern working from home in Toronto. I really enjoyed my internship so far and I've learned so much from it. I've met so many incredible people and it has been a really great experience. If you have any questions for me, I'm happy to answer them in the comments below and stay tuned for more videos. I'm going to be heading back to campus for my senior year in a couple of weeks so I'm going to try to vlog my senior year but we'll see how that goes. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!